Defense giant Northrop Grumman Corporation was awarded an integrated modification and maintenance contract from the U.S. Navy for E-6B Mercury aircraft. Need to know an E-6B plane is a large, high-tech aircraft that can communicate with important assets such as nuclear submarines and is built with a system that can launch intercontinental ballistic missiles. The plane was originally set up as a Takamo aircraft, which stands for take charge and move out. In the crisis, E-6 planes would get airborne and then unspool a wire antenna just over 5 miles long. The very low frequency band antenna allows the E-6 to communicate with the U.S. Navy's ballistic missile submarines at sea. These communications could include orders to unleash their deadly Trident D-5 nuclear-tipped missiles in retaliation against any adversary that launched a surprise attack. NG says the work will be performed at Northrop Grumman's Aircraft Maintenance and Fabrication Center in Lake Charles. Modification focused laser on providing the most relevant capabilities while improving mission readiness, said Mary Petrison, Corporate Vice President and President of Defense Systems at Northrop Grumman. As leaders in aircraft sustainment and modernization, the U.S. Navy's E-6B Mercury fleet is another example of our strong partnership with the Navy in achieving those goals. Over the next five years, Northrop Grumman will perform modifications to the Navy's E-6B aircraft improving command, control and communications functions that connect the National Command Authority with the United States nuclear triad. The company will establish a consolidated production line for core modifications required under the $111 million contract. Northrop Grumman may also take on additional smaller modifications and select depot maintenance tasks as required. As part of the critical take charge and move out to Camo strategic communications mission, the E-6B operates across a wide frequency spectrum to transmit and receive secure and non-secure voice and data information. The aircraft provides survivable, endurable, reliable airborne command, control, and communications in support of the President, Secretary of Defense, and the United States Strategic Command. The E-6 Mercury has the ability to start a nuclear war against Russia or China if ordered by President Joe Biden in a military that operates Raptor stealth fighters, A-10 tank busters, B-52 bombers and Harrier jump jets, the U.S. Navy's placid-looking E-6 Mercury, based on the 707 airliner, seems particularly inoffensive. But don't be deceived by appearances. Though the Mercury doesn't carry any weapons of its own, it may be in a sense the deadliest aircraft operated by the Pentagon, as its job is to command the launch of land-based and sea-based nuclear ballistic missiles. Of course, the U.S. military has a ground-based strategic global operations center in Nebraska and land-based transmitters for communicating with the nuclear triad. However, the E-6's sinister purpose is to maintain the communication link between the National Command Authority, starting with the President and Secretary of Defense, and U.S. nuclear forces, even if ground-based command centers are destroyed by an enemy first strike. In other words, you can chop off the head of the U.S. nuclear forces, but the body will keep on coming at you, thanks to these doomsday planes.